What's going on everybody? Master FPV here. Going to be doing a review on a motor that most of you probably don't even know exists. Actually, it kind of doesn't. There's only two. And Team Motor was cool enough to send me a motor to try out. So, here it is. F40, 1900 kV. Six inch greatness right here. So yeah, let's check it out. So we have these really cool motors made by, of course, T-Motor. They are F40 Pros, 1900 kV. You can pretty much see a pretty obvious difference in the rest of their Pro Series motors, being that these have copper windings. Not sure exactly why they went with the copper windings, and honestly, I don't really think it matters that much, but they are thicker than the normal windings on the Pro Series motors, but they are 1900 kV, so these are targeted for six inch builds. And before you guys get all judgmental, these are experimental. The windings are not 100% perfect. They aren't done by a machine. These are hand woven, they're hand built, and so I can't really say anything bad about them because they have the same quality that the rest of the Pro Series motors have. These are the F40 2600 kV Pros. So you can see it's got the typical silver windings. And these have copper windings. It's pretty cool looking. And they're not 100% perfect, so before you guys go and judge and say, oh my god, those windings are so terrible. These are hand done, they're experimental, and there's only a few made, so we're going to just see how they perform. We're not going to care too much about aesthetics. These have the typical features that you see in all of T-Motors, Pro Series motors, of course are built with the high standards that T-Motor has. Many of you may want to argue that, whatever, all motors have issues. Every manufacturer has problems, all their departments and quality has issues, it happens. The one thing that stands out about T-Motor is that their public relations and their customer relationships are way, way closer knit than the rest of them out there. If you have an issue, they take care of it. And with these, I'm pretty sure that they're going to kill the six inch market. So I'm really excited to see how these perform. They are really nice looking. I mean, it's T-Motor. And, and these are the F40s, so they are race proven. Lots of pilots run these. They're, they're just absolutely amazing motors. So we're going to go ahead and, and put these on a six inch build and see how they perform. Because performance is what we care about, right? All right. So I'm see you guys outside.
I just got done flying this monster. It, it is a monster. Um, <laughs> they're astounding. These motors are pretty crazy. So I put this through the ringer. I did 4S, 5S, and it's success. Didn't like success too much. We weren't sure if success was going to work. Um, I asked T-Motor and they weren't positive and um, they said that 5S would definitely work. And to be honest, 5S is the sweet spot for these motors. I mean, it is absolutely ridiculous and buttery, buttery smooth. So let me show you my PIDs. So here we go, quick look. These are my PIDs. No filters were used. Don't like them. So after seeing my PIDs, um, you guys can tell like for a 6S, that's, that's kind of high. So vibrations were minimal. I, I had a really easy time tuning this and I honestly could have gone a lot higher with my P gain. These motors are efficient. They're very efficient being 1900 kV, but I got about four minutes of flight time on a 1550. I got about four and a half minutes on a 1600 and I got about maybe three minutes on a 5S, 1300. Um, yeah, it's easy to say they are efficient. They're, they're powerful. Now, I only tested it with HQ dual blades. I didn't do tri blades just because they're experimental. I didn't know how they were gonna handle an aggressive prop. So I went safe and I did dual blade. So, but these things can handle maybe a six by four by three, but 4.5 may be pushing it, but it's up to you if you don't wanna fly a long time. But I have to say, these motors are just incredible. I, you guys saw from the flight footage, they're, they're amazing. So yeah, T-Motor, you guys did an excellent job with these um, 1900 KV 2304 F40 Pros with copper windings. All right, so real quick, it's my setup. I'm flying another x Skull by MIG Vice. Awesome frames. <laughs> the only frames I fly. F40 Pro 1900 KV. F30 amp ESC's KISS fly controller and some crazy, crazy, crazy bobbins that are made of silicone that I got from Rotor Geeks. Can't find them anywhere else. So if you guys want these, they actually reduce vibrations at an incredible rate. I had absolutely no issues. There was no crazy vibrations. The mid oscillations were just pretty much not present. So yeah, I have to say, incredible. Absolutely incredible. All right, so there you have it. F40 Pro, 1900 KV. They're monsters. They're awesome. Buttery. <laughs> and this is my little girl. Her name's Avery. And she helps me with all my builds, actually. So, yeah. Big props to her. Give me five. <coughs> yeah. All right. Hope you guys liked it. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know how I did, how I didn't do, or, yeah, if I did bad or not. Whatever. All right. <laughs> Thanks. See you guys next time. Bye.